Adventurers, we are ready to go! Are we ready? We are in a place called Tornado Alley. Well, that's comforting. Um, I don't know if we're gonna fit underneath that, Jason. This might be the most stressful road trip we have ever taken. <laughs> We're driving up all together in the family, except for Clay. The last time we took two vans. We are fully packed for our month on the road. Are you ready to do this, honey? I'm ready. This chair is very comfortable. Every day for a month. Yes. Wait. Yes. Hey, right, Dad, take us out. I feel like Star Trek. The levelers are up. Yep. yep. Oh my! Don't hit the rocks. Don't hit the rocks. Oh my gosh! Oh my okay. gosh! Okay. So first rule. Don't freak out. Maybe I should go to the back. Take it out. I'm really nervous. It's so big. It's so big. I have to not make noises because Dad doesn't like it when I make noises. <laughs> like no, you make noises when we go. <gasps> and we're off. Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! Oh wait, I forgot nothing. I Aha! hope. So. All right, we have been on the road for a couple hours. Look at Cora just made. Wyatt is playing. Huh? You playing? Oh wait, you're playing past the pig. Oh yeah. Who do you think's gonna win? Why A or why B? The girls are crafting. And Shay is sleepy. Raquel is sleepy. Dad is a beast. We've been driving for almost nine and nine and a half hours, I think. We got kids sleeping. It's almost 1 a.m. No biggie. We got hundreds and hundreds of miles to go. A new day! Dad has been traveling and traveling. We arrived at what time? 3.12. 3 in the morning and fell asleep. And then this morning at 7.30, we left this morning and around 8 o'clock, I went back to sleep. So this morning, kids have been awesome. Got their school done. Look at this. This is like an awesome sight to see. How are you guys feeling day two on the road? Great! Yeah? Twenty hours in the RV. Not even one day into our trip, and we're like, uh. "All right, I'm gonna try and get the generator to start so that we can have some AC in the back." Here it is. I think we have some power. Woohoo! Kids have windows open. Super hot. We have air conditioning, and that means we have power to the TV. The kids have figured out how to hook the Nintendo DS up to it so they can play Minecraft. And gosh, it is hot. But guess what, we have something fun. We are going to be going to a lake today. Who's ready to get wet Me. and cool off? Missouri! Yeah. Oh yeah! So the inverter is not working. We take turns sitting in front of the AC. We have arrived, we are plugged in, we now have air. We are like so sweaty. But we have made it to Missouri. Our first destination is this beautiful lake of Smithville Lake. We're so excited to go and jump in the water. Who's with me? Me! Me! Woo! They're playing there and we got lunch, dinner going, got rice, some chicken. <sighs> Wyatt's gonna figure out what games we're gonna play tonight. Guess what, it's time for dinner. So we got rice, chicken, Bunch of veggies. Yummy! And Raquel has the guac and the sauce. All right, day three in the RV. We're about 40 hours into this trip. Nobody's willing to switch me seats. <laughs> Hands down, that's not gonna happen. We are not driving. And now, we are on the road. We just hit a historical site. We're going to another historical site. 
If you are want to see all the fun actual sites we're gonna go to on some of this adventure, go over to the Ohana Adventures channel. You can see those, but we're gonna show a little bit more of what happens inside the RV because it's gonna be a long, long month. We swapped two boys for this cute girl. I think it was a great trade. We got the craft section going on right now. We're making bracelets. Raquel is wielding a weapon to eat her apple. Um, I don't know if we're gonna fit underneath that, Jace. 14-2. Uh, what will happen if we don't? It's gonna knock one of the things off our roof. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. a little intense. already missed our tour of one of the historical sites that were here. You have to reserve a tour because of um, COVID and stuff. So we already missed one. Come on, come on, come on. We're gonna go late, 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 late. Let's go. All right, we had a long day today traveling. Oh, there's something there. And adventuring in this awesome town here. Now it is dinner time. I'm cooking dinner, but the kids gotta get their school done. They are working really hard. Yep, even on vacation, we try to get school done. Especially in the RV, it's awesome because we can pack all this stuff. We've had a few hiccups as we've been traveling. A few things have broken down, but we're trying to make it work. Right, we have been in the RV for 74 hours. So far, no one is fighting too much. All right, Corporate EB spell. Suddenly, fortunately, and actually are all introductory words. Going outside, we are cooking, we are plugged in. You can hear the, cic the cicadas, cicadas. And we have this RV spot basically to ourselves. Look at this. We are surviving, we're doing good. We've had someone not feeling well. Raquel had cramps earlier today. There's been a little bit of pestering, but we're doing fine. Only day four into our journey and we're doing fine. We can make it a month, we can make it. We are literally in the middle of nothing. The main highway was closed and it didn't show a detour and now we're in Farmersville, America, which is beautiful, but we don't know where we're going. Now we are out on the open road, except for exploring no, this, farmland. This is not an open road. This is a very small pothole road, and I am in a 40-foot RV. There's a big semi-truck coming. Huge semi ah! coming. Ready, set. Ah! <laughs> 10 hours on the road today. We finally made it to a nice road. Dad's got five more hours to go. We just passed into Indiana. Hey. So we just hit rainstorm yeah, status. <laughs> Kids aren't phased. They're playing Minecraft. How's that rainstorm treating you? Treating me. Clean off the windshield a little bit, but it's hard to see the lanes because. It was blacktop, and so all you see is reflection, so you can't see the lane markers. Whoa, tons of huge lightning again. I don't know how to anticipate what's happening. It's a lot more adventurous than I thought it would be. Right up ahead, it's super dark and lots of lightning, so we're hoping it's not thunder. Storm. Wait, is it the wind that's pushing us? Yeah, yeah look at all the, the leaves. Wind. Look at everything blowing at us. Oh my gosh. We are going to be pulling off because I think this wind and rain is getting kind of dangerous and hope it passes for a little bit. We're going to just go and park at this uh, gas station. Yeah, pilot to the right. All right, we're going to hunker here. We've just pulled over. There are so so many trucks way back there. This is scary. All right, well, we'll be fine. 
we're gonna, gonna go be check. fine. I'm gonna go talk to some local truckers and see what they're thinking, because they're the ones with CB radios and they can all talk to each other. That's a good idea. So I'm gonna go see. Oh, old man. We're at this stop. Maybe there's something to do. Why, Shay? What are you doing? Oh, oh, I have an idea. Let's play a game. Turn around. Turn around, both of you. Face the back, both of you. Okay, I'm gonna give you something to smell, and you guys have to guess the smell. Ready? And we're gonna do this one. Okay, this is, here we go. Ready? Okay, let's smell this. Ready, close your eyes. Here, Shay, smell really good. Pineapple. Coconut. Pina colada. She is cheating. I promise I'm not. I talked to the truckers. They said one tornado touched down, but there was another one that didn't quite touch down. And so they're all bunkering down, waiting for this to go, because they said sometimes it goes crazy. So not going crazy. The car is all locked up and set underneath their thing. Oh, no. I don't know if this is the best place to be or not, but anyways, there it is. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys, come look at the window. So dark. It is only like three in the afternoon, mind you, so it should be bright. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's dark. Look at this. It is like heavy rain. We wanted to get to this really awesome RV park. We're actually only three hours away from it, next to a nice river, but I don't know if we're gonna actually make it. Oh. This is kind of stressful. We are in a place called Tornado Alley. Well, that's comforting. All right, while we are hunkering down, we're gonna play some entertaining games to keep us entertained. If you get the most points, you win a bag of candy. Here we go. Are you ready? Yes. I am going to say a candy. I'm thinking of a candy, so maybe I'll pick like trolley. And I would say it starts with the letter T, or I would say it's a blue bag. I'm gonna give you a hint, okay? And the first one to say it gets a point. The first person, listen, the first person to three points wins a bag. This candy is after a drink. Go, 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 go. Shay got it, Shay gets one point. That should have been like so easy. That is easy, here we go. This candy bag is yellow. Sweet, sweet. Evie gets the one point, chocolate. Hershey's kiss. Wyatt said it first. All right, this is brand starts with an H. Haribo. Har Haribo. Haribo what? This Haribo is sour. Sour streamers. Sour Haribo. streamers it is. This candy is after a fruit. Swedish fish watermelon. Oh, oh, Shay got it. Shay is at three points and gets a bag. We just finished our game. Any update? Go. So I'm gonna go outside and secure the... make sure all the windows and everything are good. And then I'll come back in. It's pouring though. This candy has multiple colors. Stunning Star Wars. Nope. Okay, give us the airheads. Airheads, why I got the airheads. This candy is not labeled as a candy, it's marketed as a snack. Fruit Gushers. Mm, oh, no. That, that would kind of work, but yes. it's Welch's, Welch's fruit, fruit yeah, snack. You could jump with this candy. This? Uh, sweet tart rope. Rope, that's it, she gets the rope because it's a jump rope. I prefer red vines too. Oh, Twizzlers. Twizzlers. Oh, Kel gets the second point. We are tied, Wyatt. Oh my gosh, Shay just broke it. This candy is known as starts with a fruit, ends with a body fruit part. Punch, mixed fruit. Oh wait, sweet no. fish. Sweetest fish. Ends with a body part. Fruit, fruit by favorite. the foot. Oh, she gets it. Where's the she fruit gets by the it. foot? It's down there. All right, I'm gonna let the, the the rest of the kids get two things to share between the three of them. I'm gonna go find something healthy to eat. Okay, we're gonna check out because there was just an announcement that's saying um, if you're not pumping yes, you have to move, but there's no more parking spot, so we might have to leave, and I'm not sure where we're gonna go now. Ready? Gotta run. Thank you so much. Go, go, go. I got it, thank you. Ready, go, go, go. Go, go, go! Ah! Go, go, go! So, did you get the warning? They lifted the tornado warning for this area. Are we ready to, are we okay to go then? Uh, in the direction we're going, yes. If we head south, definitely not. So we're okay for a little bit? For a little bit. We're okay, yay! We are hitting the road again. So many people are getting off the freeway. I think that cop is directing traffic because it's like a major city in this gas station. That was really scary. <laughs> a little bit. 
Whoa! Lightning everywhere still! Are you sure we're out of the storm? No, we're not out of the storm. I can't even see in front of me right now. This might be the most stressful road trip we have ever taken. Some of those uh, delayed flights don't look so bad now, huh? <laughs> and we are only four days? What day is it? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday? It's Thursday. We are 96 hours into our trip. That's it, only 96 hours. If the weather persists like this, I think we might have to go home. Okay, it's starting to get a little better. We're gonna play and try to call my kids. Hey dad, how you feeling? I'm feeling good. Yeah? Yeah, I'm okay. Okay. Um, and then... Ah! 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 The rain has lightened up a ton, and I think yeah, we are traffic. passing. The traffic is thickening up. It's true, we are oh. we are going through a major city right now, and it's really stressful in the cities because people zoom in in front of the RV, and Jace has to like slow down, but like the RV doesn't stop as fast as a normal car. It's so stressful. We're making it out of the storm, and we are only like an hour away from our destination, which is incredible. You guys ready to stop? We had lots of fun here. We survived the tornado warning and the crazy thunderstorms and the rain, but now we're on to our next adventure. Go and make sure that you guys are following us along because we have so many more adventures in the RV. Guess what, guys? What? We might play last to leave the bathroom. What? Don't you know. We'll see you guys next time. Mahalo! Bye.